Let's go back to symptoms a little bit. You said there's so many symptoms of this. Can someone have just one symptom and have the disease? And how does somebody know? You, you mentioned migraine headaches. A lot of people suffer from those. Is, does that necessarily mean that they have celiac disease? And, and at what point should people get to go and take that blood test, I guess, you know? Well, it, you know, it, it, the people have to look at, you know, we, first of all, let's step back one, one minute. If somebody in your family has celiac disease, the entire family needs to get tested. Mm -hmm. So that is without a question. So if somebody has celiac disease, your grandparents, um, somebody, uh, a cousin, you need to get tested if you have symptoms or not. Because believe it or not, some people do not have very many symptoms, but it can start to cause long-term damage and eventually lead to cancer. So it leads to things like um, lymphoma, thyroid cancer, and you know, and and can cause you know, inf it causes inflammation in your body, which can lead to cancer. So if you have a symptom, you know, and again, we have the symptom, we have the symptom checklist. I don't know if you want to look at some of these symptoms. Again, there's 250 mm -hmm. to 300 signs and symptoms. Um, and you have autoimmune disease that runs in your family. Um, you have constipation, you have diarrhea, you have you know, even one symptom. The first step is a blood test. It's a $30 blood test. So if you're in co covered by insurance um, or you, know, you can afford that $30 blood test, I would say you know, ask your doctor to test you. And I even say insist your doctor test you because it could be what's causing all your problems. Mm -hmm. Fatigue. I mean, I had one uh, person who had, uh, he, he kept trying to go give blood, and one of the common symptoms is anemia. So he kept going to give blood, and he was anemic. And he couldn't figure out why he couldn't give blood. He was tested for celiac. He came back positive. Not until he went on the gluten-free diet did he realize how sick he was. He said, I got my energy back. I got my life back. This is unbelievable, mm -hmm. because I had no idea, because I'd been living sick for so long, I had no idea what was wrong with me.